You two drop in here. I want to go down 100 yards where she can't ruin this for me. Just watching? Why does it scow? No scow. Will Kay Stutton die in season five of Yellowstone? The major character's death seems to be implied by the show. Here's why every hint seems to be pointing toward Case's impending death. Not only that, but season five of Yellowstone has a lot more to offer. It proves Rip Wheeler is for sure the ultimate cowboy crush. Keep watching to find out more. First up, will Case be dying in season five of Yellowstone? Some events in Yellowstone season five appear to be pointing to the fact that Case's eventual death might be around the corner. Case's visions in Yellowstone season four finale ended up revealing Case's two different paths. Not only that, it also revealed betrayal, retribution, and death. What's more, Case's imminent death may have been the reason Monica even cried as she said her final goodbyes to Case and Tate before they left for the cattle run. Though Yellowstone Season 5 began with the death of baby John Dutton, specific hints suggest that Case will be the next Dutton to perish. While the unintentional killing of wolves in Yellowstone National Park by ranch hands Ryan and Colby does not appear to be related to Case, for instance, it is still important to note that the wolf has been disclosed to be Case's spirit animal and protector. Another Another hint can be found in the promo for Yellowstone Season 5, Episode 6, which shows an EMT helicopter emerge after the majority of the cast has left for the cattle run. The promo also shows John Dutton comforting Monica, Tate, and Summer, who are visiting the Dutton gravesite, and the core ranch cast. But with the exception of Case, they're reacting to something unsettling. These hints point to Case's death in Yellowstone Season 5. You're my wife. You're my best friend. You're my only friend. Next up, what would Case's death mean for Yellowstone? If Case dies, the fate of the Yellowstone Dutton Ranch becomes even more uncertain, and despite what it could mean for the show, it would definitely be a brave move that could give the show a much-needed twist. Case is the heart and soul of Yellowstone, acting as a living link between the Dutton Ranch and the Broken Rock tribes. Despite the fact that Case has already chosen Monica and Tate over the Dutton Ranch, everyone in his life persuaded him to stay on as Livestock Commissioner, and as John disclosed to Clara, he still considers Case to be his only son. If Case dies, the world around him could completely collapse. Case will be laid to rest on the Dutton Ranch and as a full member of the Confederated Tribes of Broken Rock, just like Case and Monica's son, baby John Dutton. On the one hand, it would be the single most tragic death in Yellowstone's history. If Case dies, it could be the tipping point for Governor John Dutton to finally come to an agreement with Broken Rock Chief Thomas Rainwater, or it could be the catalyst for the conflict between the two to escalate, because Case would no longer be around to keep the peace. In any case, it could be exactly what Yellowstone requires to move its overarching plot forward. Look at me. And know that I'm not your friend. Coming up, could the implication of Case's death mean entirely something else? Yellowstone's suggestion that Case could perhaps die can also be a red herring designed to conceal the fact that Yellowstone audiences should actually be concerned about Lloyd. Though it will not have the same impact as Case's death, Lloyd's death will carry significant weight. The death of longtime Yellowstone Dutton ranch hand Lloyd Pierce would also foresee a grim fate for the ranch, where Lloyd is the oldest working branded cowboy. Yellowstone Season 5 flashbacks may feature young Lloyd, who is played by Forrest Smith, the real-life son of 4 J. Smith who plays Lloyd Pierce. When set against these scenes, Lloyd's death could be a touching tribute to the life of the Montana cowboy, and it would fit perfectly in Season 5's Community Cattle Run. In any case, whether it's Case, Lloyd, or another beloved cast member, death is on the way in Yellowstone Season 5. Dad, you have an edge today. Shit, you might just cheat death yet. Know where I am. How am I supposed to get there? The old Irish way. Moving on, Yellowstone Season 5 proves Rip Wheeler is the ultimate cowboy crush. Fans of Yellowstone are all too aware of how hot Rip Wheeler, played by Cole Hauser, is. The cowboy is dreamier than ever in Season 5 of Taylor Sheridan's well-liked Western drama, which follows the family of Montana ranch owner John Dutton, played by Kevin Costner. Since the first episode of the series aired in 2018, viewers as a whole have identified with, admired, drooled over, and fallen in love with the impulsive ranch foreman who consistently shows up for the Duttons. When Rip was just a teenager, John took him in after he killed his cruel stepfather for killing his mother and brother, according to flashbacks. Rip put forth a lot of effort over the years to earn the second chance John granted him, never losing his perspective or his gratitude. Rip's now regarded by John as his right-hand man on the ranch. He has complete faith in him to run the bunkhouse, make decisions while he is away, and most importantly, love his daughter Beth, played by Kelly Riley. Moron, are Hauser and his character Rip the same? It's no secret that Hauser is attractive because he has previously been named People's Sexiest Man Alive. In spite 
spite of the fact that he effortlessly wears a cowboy hat, boots, and other traditional ranch attire, Rip's unmistakable charm and understated s appeal aren't merely the result of his good looks. Being merely human, Rip occasionally loses his composure and has committed his fair share of immoral acts, even a few murders, for the benefit of his newfound family. But in general, the man is a seasoned soul with a reserved attitude, tremendous self-control, and immense patience. He is passionate, courteous, and also able to laugh at himself if needed. While Season 5 put all these dreamy characteristics on full display, they also look back into his past, making it clear how remarkable they truly are. In the premiere for Season 5, flashbacks depict a disastrous date between Teen Rip, played by Kyle Red Silverstein, and Teen Beth, played by Kylie Rogers. After being startled by that one flashback, Beth rushes to the kitchen to apologize to Rip for her previous treatment of him. He tells her he means this with love, but it's too messed up for him, and when she looks back on the past with remorse, Rip says he's happy and he wants her to be too. Before kissing her and saying, I love you, he compliments her on her big heart, grants her permission to move on, and laughs that she put him through though, what a man. Up next, his looks aren't the only thing that makes Rip attractive. When another unpleasant memory from the past awakens Beth from her slumber in episode 5, watch him right away, we see that same ability for forgiveness. I didn't mean to wake you, honey, Rip says as he gets ready for work in the bathroom when Beth enters the room. He tells her he tried to stay silent and apologizes. She gives him her word that he didn't wake her before, asking about his memories of them when they were children. I think about now. I think about tomorrow, but I don't give much thought to yesterday. Baby, yesterday is what eats everybody. That's why I don't think about it, he says. After those wise remarks, Rip interrupts Beth's gloomy reflection with a good morning, a smile, a chuckle, a touch on the arm, and a kiss. We love to witness Rip in all his glory. Rip has demonstrated this season that he is a natural protector, solver, and defender when he expressed worries about John's appointment as governor, broke the news that he had to put down a horse, and attempted to resolve the Yellowstone wolf snarl. In addition, he made a point of telling Carter, played by Finn Little, orphans don't get shipped out here, in case you haven't noticed that this was true, and he mediated Beth Beth's fight with Summer, played by Piper Parabo, in a cool and composed manner. Rip, despite the early struggles of Season 5, has been all smiles. Coming up, Rip's interactions with Beth makes him all the more attractive. We saw one of Rip's most endearing moments with Beth in Episode 5, and we can't stop drooling over it even now. Being haunted by the past, Beth decides to ride along with Rip and the ranch staff while they brand cattle, but Rip points out that it would take two days of non-luxury riding. She becomes defensive when he questions her level of interest, to which he tells her to put her crazy away and asks her if she wants to come with him to the gathering tomorrow. Though after quickly learning that a straightforward aggressor isn't what she needs, Rip changes his strategy, averts his gaze, and addresses Beth as his love of my life, and says he doubts that he could endure two days by himself away from her. Will Case Dutton die in Season 5 of Yellowstone? The major character's death seems to be implied by the show. Here's why every hint seems to be pointing toward Case's impending death. Not only that, but Season 5 of Yellowstone has a lot more to offer. It proves Rip Wheeler is for sure the ultimate cowboy crush. Keep watching to find out more. That's all for this video, folks. Tell us, do you think Case Dutton will die in Season 5? In the comments down below. And remember, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more in the future. Thanks for watching. See you next time.